Hey guys, uh, today I'm gonna make another video for you guys, not about flowers somewhere in a park or about how the environment looks, but we're gonna do another video about translation from English to Dutch. And as a special theme for this week, because this weekend it's finally Halloween and I love Halloween, wow. and I can dress up like a zombie or a vampire or a werewolf or something like that and watch scary movies who does love scary movies or better who doesn't comment down below what's your favorite scary movie because i should need some recommendations for movies that i didn't watch yet and that i would like to watch this year then let's jump right into it and find some translations from english to dutch about halloween so the first word about halloween when you say it in Dutch, it's the same as in English, like Halloween is Halloween. Halloween, Halloween. <clears throat> and then what can you not forget when you're thinking about Halloween? A pumpkin, of course, because people like to carve out pumpkins and place them on their bench or somewhere in the house with like an evil look, an evil smile, and they put a candle in it and you got a lightning pumpkin for Halloween, that's for the theme. So, a pumpkin in Dutch is pompoen. Pumpkin is pompoen. And mostly around Halloween we drink pumpkin soup. Like pumpkin soup is pompoenen soup. Then you got different creatures where you can dress up in like, like a witch. <laughs> like your girlfriend when she comes out of bed. Kidding. But a witch in Dutch is an hex. In hex. And a witch mostly has a black cat. And a black cat brings unluck, or it can just be a fairy tale, but who knows? I had a black cat and I was never unlucky in my life. So to me, it's a fairy tale, maybe too. It's real. But a black cat in Dutch is a zwarte cat. In zwarte cat. And Witches, when they go outside, they fly on a broomstick. And a broomstick in Dutch is a borstel. In borstel. Or, or you can also say in bezemsteel. In bezemsteel. That's, that's a better way of saying it because in bezemsteel, it's more when we talk about it when we talk about witches. And a borstel is more when we talk about cleaning the house. So let's say in still. Then, what else you got? Or like vampires. Those are the other known creatures in scary movies. And a vampire in Dutch is een vampier. Een vampier. And how do you kill a vampire? You kill it with garlic. Or with a wooden stake right through the heart. So, uh, let's see. Um, I hope I'm correct on the garlic. Yeah, garlic is correct. So, garlic in Dutch is knoflook. Knoflook. That's more to scare them away, not really kill them. But you can put garlic or knoflook, knoflook in your room. And it will keep the vampires away. Then... Some other things that where vampires are scared of is light. And lights in Dutch zijn lichten. Lichten. Then also the cross of Jesus Christ. It is cross is kruis. Kruis. So then the wooden stick that you put in the heart is in houten staaf. In houten staaf. Of een houten balk. It's up to you to choose. Then you also got werewolves. And werewolves oh, <laughs> in Dutch are weerwolven. Weerwolven. And how do you kill a werewolf? There's only one way to kill them, and that's with a silver bullet. Or a silver weapon. Any kind of silver hurts them. So, of course, it's just fiction, guys. I'm trying to tell you for the kids out there that's watching, it's not 
real, but just to have fun. So, a werewolf is a werewolf, and a silver bullet is in silver coral. Silver is silver. Silver is silver. So, what else do you got? You got hmm, just monsters in general. A monster in that is in monster. In monster. Then they mostly come out around night, and night in Dutch is nacht. Nacht. Around full moon. And a full moon is full moon. But that mostly only counts for the werewolves, so vampires, I think, they come out every night, and so do witches. And when is Halloween? It's around 31 October. And October in Dutch is October. So yeah, those are all the scary parts. When you're watching a horror movie, you see, in horror film. A horror movie is in horror film. Hmm. What else could we look for? In when looking about scary things around Halloween, a Halloween walk. Like you know, when you go walking with friends and people try to scare you, it's in Halloween toch. It's very common here, maybe not in the Philippines or the other places where people look, but it's very common to do here because here we don't do things like trick or treat, that's an American thing to do. So, trick or treat is about selling candy. And candy, I mean selling, giving away candy when they knock at your door and they're dressed up in Halloween theme. And candy in Dutch is snoop. And um, besides the pumpkin, what else do you eat the most? Uh, you also can make tomato soup with uh, balls that they say like it's eyeballs and it's uh, which soup. But normally it's just like a Halloween soup from tomato soup and tomato soup in Dutch is tomaten soup. I already told you in a previous video what are tomatoes. Tomaten, so tomato soup is tomaten soup. So those are the words for today around Halloween. Like I said comment down below if you know a good Halloween movie because that's what I like to watch around Halloween and if you like the video give it a like if you didn't subscribe it subscribe do it now fix it or I'll come hunt you. Um, have fun around Halloween. Uh, don't be too frightened or afraid. And go have some fun. Like go do some trick or treat. Or I don't know what you guys do around your region. Maybe you don't do anything around Halloween. Maybe you do. But I know that I'm gonna have fun. And I look forward to see you guys in the next video.